Hi there, it's Jennifer, and I'm here for another video in my home organizing series. Today, I'm talking about spring cleaning. Um, you may get excited about spring cleaning. You may think, uh, I don't wanna do it. But anyway, I'm talking about getting at some of those things that we tend to forget about, but really do need some attention from time to time. So, um, what I, I want to share with you in this video, my system for handling spring cleaning projects. Now, let me just say, spring cleaning is not like just, okay, I'm going to clean my sink and wipe down my counters. I mean, that's just stuff that we always do, right? And then I also have my monthly chores, I call them, things that I like to do on a monthly basis. And I'll link the video that I did about my monthly chores in the space below so you can see that. But spring cleaning to me is more like bigger projects, uh, things like cleaning behind your washer and dryer, you know, that usually we don't do unless we're moving, and, um, or behind the refrigerator, or cleaning off your patio furniture, and you know, things like that. So that's what this is. I got, um, well, my system is, is not the same as Nikki's from At Home with Nikki, but I did look at her stuff and I did get a box like she has. Um, this is a box by Semicolon, and I got it on Amazon.com. Semicolon is spelled S-E-M-I-K-O-L-O-N, and it's just a business card box, cute little business card box. And what I did with this is I filled it with cards that have different tasks to do on the cards. Now, when I was watching Nikki's video, she sets it up so that there's a section for each room of her house. And in that section, she's got, got like dust the ceiling fans uh, in that room, clean the door in that room, wash the carpets in that room. And so she has it set up like that. I have it set up so that there's one section of tasks for me and one section of tasks for my husband. They're all different kinds of things. And if the task for the day is to clean the light switch plates then I'm not just gonna do it for one room, I'm gonna go through my entire house and wipe all of those light switch plates down so, so that they'll all be clean. Some of the tasks take more time to do, some of them are little quick things. You're gonna notice when you take a look at this that my husband's section has far fewer things to do than my section, and part of that is, part of that makes sense because my husband's tasks Many of them take more time. One of his is to restain the fence. Well, that's huge because, you know, around our entire yard and on both sides. And so, so anyway, his, that's something that will take him many hours to do, whereas going around and cleaning down light switch plates doesn't take as much time. So anyway, let me go ahead and stop talking and show you this little box. Okay, here's the box, and I just put a little insert in there to say spring cleaning, and then when you open it up, there's these little cards, and I just used cardstock, cute little uh, fun decorated cardstock. This is my section right here of little things to do. <laughs> there's quite a few, and this is my husband's section, not quite so many, and then the idea of this is that I would pull out... So I take this card out, oh, and you guys, I'm not bleeding here. I just did a video and I swatched some makeup, so. All right, so anyway, um, this one says wash bedspreads. So when I'm finished washing the bedspread, then I'm gonna take this card and move it to the section behind here. And then we'll go, and I won't necessarily do these in order, but like this one says change out the placemats. I like to put out some seasonal looking things for my placemats. I've got a whole bunch of them. Wash pillows. Did you know you can wash your pillows? Like the ones you sleep on at night? I should do a video on that. Um, straighten the master closet. So there's all different kinds of things in here that I put down. So you know what I'll do? I'm going to, in the space below, I'm just going to put a list for you of all the different things that I have here for my spring cleaning. Some of it has to do with garden stuff and outside stuff, and so it's not just all inside. And then in my, here I'll show you my husband's section. He's got like, take care of any caulking that needs to be done in bathrooms, rake up pine needles, um, 
clean out the trash bins. And so anyway, yeah, those are the things that I have. And like I said, I'll list them in the space below if you want to copy and paste those into a Word document so that then you can um, kind of adapt it and print those out, make your own little cards. I also laminated these so you just so that they would be nice and sturdy. So there you go. Um, I'm really excited about this system. I think it's gonna work out really well. I like that everything is in a place like this instead of a checklist because, you know, I don't know, it's just kind of more motivating to me, I guess, to clear out one section and keep moving these things so I know if I'm getting closer and closer to being finished. And we have most of our guests come visit us in the summer, so when this is all finished. I'm going to try to finish this by the middle of May because spring actually lasts uh, a ways into, su into summer. <laughs> I always think of June as summer. Spring always, um, spring lasts a ways into June, but I would like to have this finished by the middle of May because our guests start coming to visit us in June and I want all this kind of finished and, and the house all tidied and ready to go. So I hope that this video was helpful to you. Remember those things will be in the space below if you want to copy and paste those into a document of your own and you know make cute font and put your own cards together. But hopefully this was helpful for you. If you guys have any special things that you do for spring cleaning, I would love to hear about that. So please feel free to comment. And, and of course, if you're not subscribed, I'd love to have you come along. So if you're not subscribed, hit that button and YouTube will let you know when I upload new videos, which is several times a week. Thanks so much for watching, you guys, and take care. Bye-bye.